We have this boat here, uh, which is an end-of-life boat. This boat will be completely dismantled into its material type, categorised. We will then know which recycling route to take the various items of it and process them through. This is just one of several projects that we're working with, with local businesses. And it, the, what the aim is, is to not only uh, create a close working relationship with uh, local businesses in South Hams, but wor work towards a green eco economy in the district. So the way we're approaching this project is also, we think, genuinely a world first. We are disassembling the boat, literally piece by piece, screw by screw, bolt by bolt. And at the end, we will have fully assembled, weighed and measured every single piece of recyclable part that comes off this boat. There might be some that can get sort of resold on. The, even down to the hull itself, it's going through two very, very advanced pro processes of, of um, treating composite waste and, and manufacturer. And we will also have a value for what this boat, of, boat is, actually, is actually worth there is a way to do this which is absolutely unique and it is thanks to the foresighted people like South Ham's District Council and Chris here at Creekside that this project is actually happening. It's not something that's happening elsewhere. There are an awful lot of uh, boats that are um, coming to the end of their natural life. We are manufacturing more boats every year and currently they tend to go to landfill and uh, the leaching of, of uh, the, they will eventually uh, decompose uh, and cause problems with, uh, with the water table and pollution. Uh, and also some of them just end up at the bottom of the river or at the bottom of the sea and uh, cause all sorts of uh, problems. This small project demonstrates that uh, this is possible to uh, deconstruct these things and, and uh, in such a way that each component part can go to, um, uh, to be reused or recycled.